Our next guest is a talented actress you know from films like It Follows, The Guest, and Watcher. She stars in Long Legs, which is in theaters now. Let's take a look. Did you want to be an FBI agent when you were a little girl? No. I actually wanted to be an actress. That messes up kids. So they say. Is it scary being a lady FBI agent? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, it is. Please welcome to the show, Micah Monroe, everybody. <laughs> I'm doing very good. This is your first late night show. It is. Well, I I'm... said to myself, as long as I don't, you know, swear or trip, I think we are in the clear, right? You know what? <laughs> and if you want to swear, go for it. Oh, I can? Yeah. There oh. you go. Um, uh, congratulations. Uh, this film uh, had a great first weekend, uh, wonderful reviews. Um, it, I know only uh, from the billing that Nick Cage is in it. Correct. Because in the trailer, we don't get to see Nick Cage. Correct, yes. The, the marketing team behind this has been brilliant and I think it's uh, gonna be very fun when people see what he looks like in this. Yeah, there's like a, almost a moment in the trailer where you see what he looks like and then they sort of cut away. But you also did not know what he was gonna look like. Correct, yes. So when did you first see what he looked like? Well, the director wanted to keep us separate throughout the whole filming. So we were probably about three weeks in and- So you've never met him? Never met him. Okay, they, they you kept have us never seen him out of makeup either. Yes, okay. correct. Completely separate. I wasn't shown any photos of what he looked like. The director wanted to keep it very secret because he wanted to wait until, you know, there's this big sort of climactic scene where we meet up uh, and I interrogate him. And so it wasn't until I was brought up to the interrogation door, the director called action, and I walked into the room and there was Nick Cage in like, I mean, it was <laughs> crazy. <laughs> there we go. Um, do your parents like watching you in horror films? Um, my mom loves it. Okay. My mom is, you know, number one fan. Here's so a, she... your mom, uh, this is your mom at the premiere holding your FBI badge very proudly. Correct. Yeah. I, I gave her that, you know, I brought that back from set and I think she brought it to just sort of show off to everyone. Like I, I have the FBI badge <laughs> right. to show at the premiere. Yeah, yeah, no, it was good. It was good. That's great. It might also be against the law to have a fake FBI badge. You would think. Yeah. Um, yeah. But your dad does uh, likes it less? Yeah, no, no, he, he really hates it. He doesn't like seeing me in these, you know, um, very scary, intense situations, which is understandable. Yes. yes. Is it as scary and intense for you now when you watch them? No, no, God, no. It's, it's, uh, it's like not scary at all when I watch. I, I watched this film, Long Legs, with friends, and I kept turning to them like, is this scary? Is this a scary movie? Because I don't know. <laughs> Well, I guess when you make it, yeah, it takes it. Although yes. they scared you when, I'm assuming the first time you said Nick Cage. It was yes, little, yes, well, yeah. my heart rate, they, which they've, you know, released, I think, you know, my actual heart rate. Yeah, so there was a, the sound guy, you were so, your heart rate was so high when you saw Nick Cage, they <laughs> caught it on your microphone. <laughs> and by the way, you're in a lot of these movies. Yes. And that's how scary it was. Yes, Yeah. correct. Wow. No, it was it was something. Did you uh, were these kind of movies that you liked watching uh, when you were little? Yes, I loved horror movies. It's fantastic. I loved them. I feel like a lot of people in this genre are usually like I hate horror movies, but I like it was a very important part of my childhood. And horror. then do you feel like you had I mean, it follows one of the great horror movies of the last 20 years. When you were making that, did you know, oh, this one this is something special because you had seen enough horror movies to know it was very different? No, I had no idea. Okay. I mean, you, have you seen It Follows? Yes. Okay, so you know the concept. It's yes. weird. Yes. Imagine reading the script of yeah. that. I was like, this is going to be. <laughs> but I was like, I got to pay my rent and uh, feed myself. So So uh, then you got the extra bonus that yes, it was an awesome yes, movie. Yes, yes, yes. Um, before uh, you were in acting, you were, uh, is, is professional the right, can I say a professional? Yes. You were a professional kite surfer. Yes. Okay. <laughs> this is, um, I mean, uh, what? 
Yeah, correct. Yeah. I say the same thing. I'm like, how did, what? So what age that? do you get into it? Um, I learned when I was 13. Okay. My, my dad started when I was about 11 and I was obsessed. I was always begging him to teach me. And finally at 13, my mom was like, okay, you can teach her. Okay. So, oh, so she was holding back. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's an extreme sport. Yeah. There's a lot of injuries. Okay. And, what Stuff. is the most, I, 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 apologies for my ignorance, what is the most common way to hurt yourself kite surfing? Oh, just, I mean, I cracked my head open. Okay. Yes. Well, so, I'm very you know glad that. they put it back together. It, it's, it's, <laughs> thank you, you, Seth. You can't tell at all. Thank you, Seth, I appreciate that. <laughs> um, uh, when you first started acting, is this the sort of thing you put on your resume as a special skill? Of course. Just in case? Oh, yeah, no, yeah. that was, that was top. <laughs> And then, you know, some some taekwondo that I never did and other, right. you know, and special so, and, skills. But you've never been on a movie set where they've actually called you out on it and, like, the no. next scene's kite surfing. No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. Have you, do you do it recreationally anymore? I do. I okay. do. I, I take trips with, with my family. And it's, you know, I think it's a healthy, yeah. you know, to have something else. Were you good right away when you started doing it at 13? No. Okay. No, it took but you time. Got, but you're good. I did. I, I got very good. Okay, yes, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Like the kind of good where, like, other kite surfers are like, wow. Yeah, I think right. so. All right. Yeah, they're kind of like, hmm. <laughs> Yeah, they're, they're that kind of person. Yeah, they're yeah. like, hmm. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> and that's how you know you got it. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, uh, I can't, I, I love your work in this genre mm -hmm. of film. I am waiting to see this uh, movie uh, with people in an audience yes, because yes. I hear it is just such a, an experience. It's pretty special. I think you'll enjoy it. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for being yeah, here. What a cool you. thing to meet you. Thank you. Uh, Mike and Monroe.